I'm really in the mood to play dress up today and just try on some fun summer outfits, spring and summer, it's kind of like interchangeable really, with some items that I recently thrifted or that I bought, styled into like full outfits. Some of these are all thrifted, some of these are newer pieces, anything that's available I'll link for you down below. If you watched my last video, which was an online thrift haul, then quite a few of those pieces are going to be sprinkled in here as well, styled into full outfits, and we're just going to have fun, you know, playing around with different trends, playing around with things that I'm personally very into right now, closet essentials, all that good stuff. And I feel like whenever I am getting ready to go do something, I'm always like, what could I possibly wear? Like I'm just, I've worn everything in my closet. What could I possibly put together that will look cute and make me feel confident? So hopefully in doing this, it'll give you a little bit of like a jumping point to go from a baseline, if you will, and say, oh, okay, I have things like that in my closet or I can thrift things similar or whatever the case. We have a lot of outfits to cover. So let's go ahead and jump in. Okay, so here we have outfit number one. One. This is a really cute kind of like 90s inspired look. You're gonna be seeing a lot of that throughout. A lot of just 90s influences because that's personally what I'm gravitated towards right now. I don't want to sound like a broken record, but in my last video, my thrift haul, I talked about how I'm just feeling super inspired by 90s fashion right now and it's making me excited to get dressed. So you're gonna be seeing a lot of that sprinkled throughout, but I love this outfit. This top is actually a recent find from Old Navy. You guys know. Oh my God. Old Navy just has like such good basics, such good activewear. There are so many amazing pieces that I have like recently discovered in my closet. I actually have another piece I'm gonna show you in a bit. And I love this kind of crochet top. It's like a little bit of a tank top. I would prefer more of like a tie front top with this, like one that's kind of open right here, but this was what I was able to find and it's affordable and cute. And then I also got like a little bandeau from Old Navy and put that underneath it as well. And it's just such a nice feeling material. I washed and dried it too, by the way. I know you're not like supposed to do that, but it looks fine. I would say though to size down, this is a little bit too big, but I honestly don't mind that it has a bit more of an oversized look. I did kind of like a French tuck, but it would also look super cute just out like this. And then this skirt is from my recent thrift haul. It's so cute. It's like the perfect slinky material. It's so 90s. I feel like there's so many other things I could do with this too. Like I love it styled with the socks and the loafers, but I also feel like it would look really cute if I just had like a black tank top on and then maybe some Sambas, like my Adidas Sambas. Us. I'd like wear those every single day anyway, but I feel like just a more casual look with this would be really adorable. You could wear a little crossbody bag. Some cute sunglasses would make this outfit, honestly. Like, look at this. I'm ready to go. This is so cute. I absolutely love this one. This is gonna be a go-to for me for the summer for sure. Next up we have this dress, which I could not be more in love with. Speaking of Old Navy, this dress is from Old Navy. It's still available now, so I'll link it down below for you. I feel like this dress and this outfit in general is like basically my last year's summer uniform. Like it's basically the blueprint, what I wore every single time I got dressed. It's just so cute. And I love the shoes with it and the socks. I just think that makes it extra cutesy. So yeah, this dress is from Old Navy. It reminds me a lot of like a Reformation dress, but obviously like, you know, an eighth of the price. It's so cute. It's kind of like a linen blend material. I love the tie straps. They have a lot of other colors as well. And I just find it so flattering. I just love the way it looks. I love the pockets. It's long enough. I got just like a regular extra large and it's long enough to where I don't have to wear any kind of like chafing product. I can just wear my bike shorts. So I love that. I just think it looks so adorable. And then these shoes are actually a recent find from Journey Collection. I have become a Journey Collection stan recently. I discovered their wide calf boots, which I did in a video probably back in like November or December of last year. And Target actually recently started carrying their shoe brand. So now I'm wearing these cute little Mary Janes that I just got, which I definitely need to break in, but like these are making my inner child so very happy right now. I feel like this outfit is super simple. You could dress it up or dress it down. You could wear sneakers with it if you wanted to be more casual. It's affordable, it's accessible, it's size inclusive. That's a huge one. I believe this dress goes up to like a 4X and Old Navy does run a little bit big, so that's great. I can just like put this on, throw a little bag over my shoulder, put on some sunglasses and I'm ready to go. And this is definitely gonna be worn a lot by me. It already has been. I took this back to Arizona for Mother's Day weekend and wore it. It's just the cutest, I love it. Okay, next up we have this very kind of like 90s ethereal butterfly 
kind of grungy look at the same time i love it this top is another recent find from my thrift haul my online thrift haul i found it on poshmark it's so cute it's kind of like a butterfly sort of corset top i love all the ribbons on it i think the details are so so cute and this skirt is actually from hollister believe it or not i had been on the hunt for a white tiered maxi skirt for i mean ever i was looking at thrift stores vintage flea markets online and i just couldn't find one so i found this one at Holster and it kind of slaps. I wore this when I was in Japan. Like I've worn it all the time recently. It's like kind of a staple in my closet now. And then these shoes are another new purchase from Journey Collection um, from Target and they're called the Carry shoe. Okay, so I had to get them. They're literally called the Carry and they're kind of like a square toe Mary Jane flat, kind of like a ballet flat. And I just think that they're so cute. They add a little bit something different to the outfit. Cause usually I would wear this with like sneakers or low top Doc Martens, which I would wear. Still cute, loafers, etc. But I just thought I would like add something a little more different and fun to the mix. So that's what this one looks like. I love it. Just like a black crossbody bag or like a cute little shoulder bag would look so cute with this. I don't have like a black shoulder bag. I only really wear crossbodies, but I think that would be adorable as well. And this is just such a cute outfit. I love it. I feel confident in it. I feel comfortable. I got my bike shorts on. It's two thumbs up from me. And next up we have maybe one of my favorite outfits as of late. Like I am genuinely obsessed with this and I'm gonna be totally honest, I 100% saw this outfit on Pinterest and I already had similar items in my closet. So this is kind of like a variation based off of that. But we have this cute little sort of like petticoat, no, not petticoat, waistcoat. I always get those two confused. This little waistcoat vest that I got to match a pair of black trousers that I wore when I was in the UK back in September. And I just feel like this is is such a chic look with black trousers, but I never thought to pair it with a pair of longer denim shorts. Like how cute is this? And then we have the socks with the loafers with it. The sort of like casual mixed with fancy, mixed with like 90s is just really giving it to me right now. I'm obsessed with this. This is probably my number one favorite outfit at the moment. The vest I think I got on ThreadUp or maybe I got on Poshmark and I think it's from Banana Republic if I'm not mistaken. And then the shorts are American Eagle. I got them recently and they're nice and long and they fit beautifully. I love them. I also ordered them in a size up. So they're like much more of a loose baggy fit and I can't get enough of them. So these are great for like, if you want like a more long short and then these loafers I've had forever. I think I got them like two years ago and I can't remember if they're from Amazon or if I thrifted them. Either way, they're a really cute addition to this. And I even feel like, okay. Bear with me here. But I even feel like if I wore a trucker hat, this would be really cute too. This edition may not be for everyone, but I have this thrifted PBR trucker hat that I honestly think would add like such a cute touch to this outfit. This is adorable. I'm into this. And I also have this smiley face one. This one I wear like all the time and I don't know, it just kind of edges it up a bit. I think they're all so cute. Like any of the trucker hats I have would look cute with this. Um, I'm obsessed. It's a 10 out of 10. There's nothing else I can say other than you need this outfit. It's comfy because we have the long shorts. We can walk around all day long. We have a nice kind of open, breathable vest. It is lined, so I probably would sweat in this a little bit, but that's okay because it's black and you'll never know. You know what I mean? This outfit is iconic. This is going to be one of my summer uniforms for sure. Comfortable, cute, casual, but like elevated casual, you know? I love it. Next up, we have a little bit of like a, I don't know, 90s meets cottagecore meets kind of like barmaid, to be honest, and I love it. This outfit is so much fun for me, and I just like love all of the elements together. I think it's like really playful and like, I don't know, borderline costumey, but like, I can still make it work. Do you know what I mean? So we'll start with this top. This top is from the Wild Fable brand by Target. I love this. I feel like it's so versatile. I can wear it with so many of my cute skirts. I've really been on a long skirts kick as you may see in my recent videos and like Instagram posts and stuff. And this is perfect. It's a nice white one to go with everything. It has like a tiny bit of a peplum situation and then kind of like a, a corset tie down the front, which I just think is adorable. I got it in an extra, extra large just because Wild Fable is a juniors brand. So I just wanted it to fit a little bit more loosely. And then the skirt is again from my recent thrift haul, my online thrift haul. I got this on Depop. I did think it was black when I bought it. And then I realized when I got it that it's brown which is fine, which is not what I was expecting at all. And then I decided to go with this pair of thrifted black cowboy boots. And I just feel like all of these look so cute together. Also, I'm really feeling like leaning into, I don't know, like the casualness and I wanna add some sunglasses. 
Hold on. I recently went to the mall with my mom, Drew's mom, and Drew over Mother's Day weekend, and we popped into Cotton On, and I got these glasses and they're everything. They're polarized. They have kind of like a pinkish lens. I feel like it really ties everything together and it just makes it so cute and fun. I will 100% be wearing this very, very soon. This outfit feels like a perfect blend of what's kind of current and trendy, but also very me. Like it just feels like my style kind of mixed into it and I love it. It's absolutely a 10 out of 10 for me. This is gonna be heavy in the rotation of outfits this summer. I can guarantee it. Next we have another casual look. I am all about like the cute comfy casual vibes in the summertime. I actually wore this exact outfit when I was back home in Arizona last weekend for Mother's Day. Um, I just wore this out and about all day and it was so comfy, so cute. It was very hot that day. So it was weather appropriate. And it's just like a classic go-to for me. I love overalls and a tube top. I think they look so cute together. I don't always wear like the one shoulder thing. I do sometimes do them like both hooked. And I just think this is so cute. It's like very effortless. It's a little something extra than just like a tank top and say denim shorts or like bike shorts or something. This tube top is from Old Navy. It has a built-in bra, which is incredible. I love it so much. I got it in this little pink color, which I think is just like a cute little fun pop of color. And then I also got it in white, which I'm gonna be wearing regularly. And I will probably buy a black one too, because they're amazing. And then these overalls, I probably got like four or five years ago at the thrift store. And I just think they're so cute and comfortable. They're a vintage pair. I think they're by like Coldwater Creek or something. Really nice long shorts. So chafe proof for the summertime. And then my platform white Converse, which are my go-to shoe. Most of the time, if you're seeing me out and about, I am wearing these Converse and I just think this is so cute. It's so casual. Again, kind of like with the sunglasses theme that I'm going for and the same ones that I chose previously. Like, look at this. This is so cute. I would also definitely wear this to Disneyland. I would replace the plain overalls with like some Disney overalls. I have some mini ones that have pink on them that would be really cute with the pink tank top. Very comfortable and perfect for summer. Gotta love it. Okay, speaking of the pink tube top, I just can't get enough of this. And I decided to throw it together with this pair of fruit pants that I got probably like two or three summers ago from an online vintage shop called Berries. I love them. I feel like this could be really casual as well if I wanted to swap out these white boots for like some white Converse, if this was more of like a daytime thing. It could also be dressed up by throwing a blazer over it. Like there's just so many different ways to style this, but I love this look. I think this is so fun. I would wear this to like a daytime event or a brunch or something. And usually when I would wear these fruit pants, I would wear like a white top, but I love this pink. I just think it's so cute. And I'm all about re-wearing my stuff. Like I'm an outfit repeater. Liz McGuire, you are an outfit repeater. That is me to a T. I absolutely will re-wear something if I think it's cute. So it's a good way to like show you different ways to wear this piece. I've thought about doing a video where I style certain pieces in like numerous different ways. So let me know if you'd want to see that. But yeah, love the pants with this and the boots are so cute. It it just feels very me. Again, threw on some fun, funky, colorful glasses. I think these are from Wild Fable. I just think this is adorable. I love this outfit so much. You will definitely catch me in this this summer. So good. All right, guys, gals, non-binary pals. This, this is it. This is the one. I love this so much. Oh my God. This outfit is one of my favorites I've put together in a really long time. I actually based this off of an outfit that I rented from Newly. I had rented a good American denim corset top and then just like, a, I think it was the brand Motel skirt. And you have the option to buy the pieces that you rent from Newly, but the prices I felt were just like not it. So I was like, let me try to find something else. So I actually found this top from Target. It's by the Universal Thread brand. It's really affordable. It's so cute. I'm obsessed with it. And then this skirt I thrifted on Poshmark. It's by Kathy Lee. And I showed that in my recent thrift haul. And then these boots are from Journey Collection. Not sponsored by the way, paid for all this with my own money. <laughs> They're the same shoe brand that I showed with like both of the Mary Janes that I tried on and I love it. I did an entire wide calf boots video like I mentioned. And this is just this and the vest with the denim shorts are like my top two by far. I just feel more me in this outfit than I have in a very long time. I just feel like this is my style entirely. I low key like this even better than the one I rented. I feel like I did even better with buying these items myself. I love the cut of this corset so much more or tank top. I feel like the skirt fits me better. I like the colors of it better. I just think this is so cute. And I have been seeing so many denim tank tops, corsets, vests, so many cute denim tops this summer. So I'm excited to have this one and it's nice and dark so that when I sweat under here, 
and right here and right here. It's not gonna show as much, you know, which I love. And yeah, I can't say enough good things about this outfit. It's absolutely my favorite and it's precious. So if you are stuck in a style rut and you're looking for something to wear and you wanna try something a little bit different, see if you can find like a denim corset or a denim tank top or vest and then throw on like a nice maxi skirt with boots. I swear you're gonna feel like a million bucks. It's so cute, so comfortable. I love it. Okay, next we have something that I wanted to include in case you were a little bit more of a casual dresser, in case you aren't into like the skirts and the dresses and things like that. And I love this look. I feel like this would be good year round as well. You could just throw on a different jacket over it. Well, I say year round, um, I live in a very mild climate, so keep that in mind. But I feel like this outfit is just gonna be a go-to for me for all spring and summer. Like it's just so comfortable and casual and you don't have to put any thought into it. It's just a tank top and trousers, which is another go-to for me. So this tank top here is actually from, I think H&M, I wanna say, and they make pretty good basics that are really affordable. So this is kind of like an ivory cream color. I love how it kind of like goes in in the front here. I just love that detail. I think it's really cute and kind of sexy, a little sassy. And then we have have these linen trouser pants and these are from Old Navy. I got them in a size extra large and they're a little bit loose and oversized, but I kind of prefer that. Like I'm just much more into a loose comfy fit these days <laughs> instead of like, you know, you can't sit down because it hurts too bad. So I love these, they're so cute. And I know that with linen, it gets comfier and like softer with each wash. So I'm definitely going to continue wearing and washing these and have them even get softer over time. And I just think they're so cute. They're actually long enough as well for me. And they're just a regular size. And I'm like 5'8", five, 5'9". Five, I paired it with my white Converse again. The platform just makes it a little, just, I don't know, extra chic, extra cute. And it's just super flowy and comfy. And linen in the summer is just mwah, amazing. I I love this. Okay, and last but not least, I wanted to end it on just another simple, casual, basic one that's very easily recreatable. Like you can probably go in your closet and have something like either of these pieces and throw them together. So we're starting off with this kind of like cute asymmetrical tank top from Wild Fable. And I love this because it's like a simple plain white tank top, just a little bit elevated. So it has like this little cutout right here. It's got sort of like an interesting cut, like it kind of cuts down in the front here which I love, I think that's adorable. And then we have it paired with this really cute maxi skirt that I just thrifted. Like when I went in the actual thrift store, um, it was kind of a fail, but I did find this and I love it. I just think it's like nice and simple to wear for all of the seasons, honestly. You could wear it spring, summer, winter, fall, layer it with different things, wear it with boots in the winter. It's just like a classic. And I wanted a black skirt that didn't have any kind of like slits or anything like that. Just kind of a nice, simple black skirt that goes with everything and then I love the Sambas with this. I think this is so cute. These are thrifted as well. I feel like this is just a classic go-to, you know, when you don't know what to wear, wear this type of outfit. I also have these blue sunglasses that I think are very cute. And this feels like a very me outfit as well. Like this just feels very authentic, very comfortable. Wear your longest bike shorts under these, honestly. <laughs> it's breathable and like open down at the bottom. So even if it's hot and sunny, you can still wear it. And I just think this is such a cute look. It's very simple very understated, but I've kind of been into that a lot more lately. And it doesn't always have to be like the flashy colors and prints and patterns and stuff. Sometimes you can just put together something simple and it looks really nice. Not to be like, you know, too overkill with the trucker hat thing, but I mean, this kind of looks really cute. It kind of does. The trucker hat might not be for everyone, but I love the pop of color and I just think it's fun for like a little something extra. So yeah, I'm really happy with how all of these turned out. These are genuinely outfits that I will be wearing repeatedly throughout the summer. So if you want, you can come back to this video and use it as outfit inspo. I feel like I'm always inspired by what other people are wearing and kind of taking elements of those things from those outfits and making it in my own style. First of all, you know, grabbing what I have in my closet already, first and foremost, then maybe thrifting it and then buying it if I can't find it. And this one was a great way to end it. It's seriously so cute, I love it. So I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. You can turn on my post notifications if you wanna be notified every time I post a new video as well. Let me know if there are any other styling videos or outfits videos that you wanna see. Also make sure you're following me on Instagram, TikTok, cause that's definitely where I'm posting a lot more of like my daily outfits, collective outfits, all that kind of stuff. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for watching. I'm sending you all of my love and I'll see you very soon in my next video. Bye.